I'm sure he wants to go down the manager's route one day as well. Um, and it's a stepping stone for him. Um, you know, the, the funny story I can tell you about, Freddie was a little bit lazy at times. Uh, I mean, we, we used to train at Sopwell House, Al, which was a hotel. You know Sopwell House well. It's a lot of where the FA Cup final team yeah. used to stay. Uh, and the car park was about 100 yards from the main entrance where we walked in. I'm sure he wants to go down the manager's route one day as well. Um, and it's a stepping stone for him. Um, you know, the, the funny story I can tell you about, Freddie was a little bit lazy at times. Uh, I mean, we, we used to train at Sopwell House, Al, which was a hotel. You know Sopwell House well. It's a lot of where the FA Cup final team yeah. used to stay. Uh, and the, the car park was about 100 yards from the main entrance where we walked in. And uh, I always remember, he always used to park in a disabled car park spot. And because he couldn't be bothered to walk the 100 yards. And I always remember Martin Keown, he's a classic. He came in one day and said, Freddie, if I see your car parked in that disabled spot once more, I'm going to knock you out. <laughs> and he never done it again. Obviously, Martin was a, an old character. And uh, Freddie always uh, he ended up parking in the uh, car park again. But he was a good, good guy, Freddie. Has he been uh, living here? He'd, he'd been, yeah, yeah. I think he lives in Hampstead yeah. in North London. Um,